Are you recording? What's up everyone? So we're doing a short video today. We're doing a uh, challenge video or it's called the Christmas tag. Now we were tagged by our sister Ravlin. You can follow her channel. I'll leave it in the description. She posts this video every Friday and Tuesday. Tuesday. Every Tuesday, Tuesday and Friday. Every Tuesday and Friday. So make sure you follow her. She's awesome. What's the basis of this thing? Um, the Christmas related stuff. So, favorite movies, I guess, memories, stuff like that. So we're just answering a bunch of questions? Yep. Okay. About experiences. So Christmas is a big deal for us. Yeah, we it's celebrate the uh, birth of Jesus. Yeah, and it's a special moment for us. But also with our families, uh, Christmas Eve is my grandpa's birthday, so Every year, uh, we would celebrate his birthday really big. Um, that's pretty much it for, for you. It's Jesus' birthday. And now, this could be controversial, and it has been for a while. Yes, he was not exactly born on December the 25th. Um, we don't actually have a scientific or historical proof of the actual date of his birth. But, you know what, as a Christian and as a lover of Christ, I love any reason to celebrate his, his coming here to this planet. And Christmas is an awesome excuse to do so. And the fact that we get to hear people sing about his birth and just the fact that he came here for us on the radio, that's awesome. So I love Christmas for that. Yeah, let's get on with this thing. Alright, so question <laughs> number one is, what is your favorite Christmas film? Without a doubt, Dr. Seuss's How the Grinch Stole Christmas. But not the Jerry, Jerry, Jimmy, Carey, Jim Carrey, not the Jim, Jim Carrey version, sorry. Um, it's entertaining, I don't hate that version, but my favorite is the cartoon version, without a doubt. And for me, I don't know if I have a favorite, I, I tend to just watch whatever's on TV, but I do enjoy Home Alone. Is that Christmassy? Yeah, of course. Okay. Home Alone. Second question is... Hold on, hold oh. on. Let me see if I can get some better lighting in here. I know. we're dark. How does it look? Better. Much better? Mm -hmm. Second question is, have you ever had a white Christmas? Yes. Duh, we're in Canada. We're in Toronto. <laughs> I think this year's the only one that might be a green Christmas. But maybe it'll, it, it, it seems to pop up randomly, so we might have a white Christmas this year too. Where do you usually spend your holiday? Home. With family. <laughs> with family. With family. Uh, whatever that may be. Yeah. But with family. Yeah. What is your favorite Christmas song? Oh come, all ye faithful. I like Silent Night. Who's your favorite artist to sing that song? I don't have a favorite. Maybe myself. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Do you open any Christmas? I mean, do you open any presents on Christmas Eve? No. Uh, midnight Christmas Day, I guess you can say. So, 12 o'clock at midnight, which is the official time for Christmas Eve. I do. Last year, I actually opened it a day before Christmas Eve because I wanted to really know what I got. So 23rd? I, yeah. So I, I portioned it. I'm like, so it won't be so bad. I'll open around mm, 11, 12 on the 23rd. Then I open another <laughs> two on the Christmas Eve, and then on Christmas Day I open the other remaining, remaining gifts. Wow. Yeah. Can you name all of Santa's reindeer? Without singing it? Because <laughs> it's a song. You can. I think you can just do it whatever, however you you can remember it. Dang. And blessed and comet and blessed blitzen. There's prancer and dancer and comet. 
and a Cupid. Cupid? Is that Cupid? Isn't that the baby with... Yeah, yeah. The old guy some sometimes. Dixon. How many rangers are there? I can't name all. No. Nope. I can no nope. fail. No. Fail. No. What holiday traditions are you looking forward to the most this year? Eating Puerto Rican food because that's the only time I really get to eat it. You? I don't think we have a Christmas tradition. It's I mean, a holiday tradition. A holiday tradition. I just look forward to saying happy birthday. Is your Christmas tree real or fake? Fake. fake. <laughs> for the past 20... 24 years for me. 26, 26, 27 years. What is the best Christmas gift you've ever received? Oh. Huh. My mom got me a, a stand-up stand mixer. I think that's my favorite for my mom. You? I don't think I have one. One specific gift. I like them all equally every time. But there's never one that stands out completely and above the rest. So I don't have a favorite gift. What would be your dream place to visit for the holiday season? My auntie. <sighs> I'm fine at home. <laughs> Just here. That's fine. I don't think I ever pictured having Christmas anywhere else. It's weird not to have a white Christmas. Why do you go to Miami? There's no snow. It's not weird. Sand! Yeah, an ocean. <laughs> no! Number 13. Are you a pro present rapper or do you fail miserably? <laughs> I'm a pro rapper. I fail miserably. <laughs> Most memorable holiday moments. I have one. It's it's a different time in my life. Well, like I said in the beginning, my family used to get together for my grandpa's birthday, and this uh, Christmas specifically, we got together at my uncle's house. By then, I think we were all like in our twenties or nineteen ish. So we were legal to drink and my uncle had a whole, all sorts of wines and stuff on the table and we all sat down. I think it was the first time my family could accept that we were um, reaching adulthood or whatever. And we all started like, just socially drinking but it was a really good time because we were just laughing about nonsense and yeah. I was really loud that day. That's all I remember. That's ironic. Your most memorable Christmas is the one you drank. Most memorable Christmas moment. I'm going to have the most memorable Christmas moment this year coming. <laughs> I know that. This year, my cousin had this brilliant idea of all of us, um, the kids. So basically, myself and my siblings and my cousins and their siblings, to wear onesies. So that's going to be awesome. We all got our onesies. They're all going to be unique to our personality. And it's going to be awesome. Blah! I have another story I just remembered. And there was this one year, I think I was 10. Um, my whole family went to my uncle's house. And for some reason, my mom decided for me and my sister to wear matching outfits. But she had the pink version and I had the beige version. But we got to my uncle's house and my cousin Jessica was also matching us. <laughs> what color was she wearing? She was wearing beige. No, pink. Pink. She was wearing pink. I was so the only one with the beige. So there's pictures and evidence of that. Quite horrible. I don't know why parents did that as if we were twins. I mean, I understand if me and Jess match because we look alike, but in general, why? And that year, I don't know what happened to my uncles and aunts, um, but they were very giving that year. <laughs> it's not, we don't get those kind of Christmases where like there's multiples of gifts <laughs> under the tree, but this Christmas, for a reason, my uncles and aunts had this whole like bag of gifts to give. They got a big bonus at work. I guess so. Um, I got this nice watch. That's, that's why it's memorable, because it had Mickey Mouse on it. And I want to share that. Yeah. And I remember dancing that day. All right, next question. What made you realize the truth about Santa? Jesus Christ. 
I don't think I ever believed in Santa, so I can't. This doesn't relate to me. Which is why my answer was Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> do you make New Year's resolutions and do you stick to them? No, I don't make them. I make a list of things that I want to conquer during the year. It's like a bucket list. Yeah, a bucket list of the year, and I get through them. I don't always complete them 100%, but I, I, I do my best. And finally, what makes the holiday special for you? Spending time with family and relaxing. I've been craving for a break. Music. I love the music of the holidays. It inspires everything else that follows. Jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle bell rock. Jingle bell swing and jingle bell swing. Like that? Mm -hmm. Alright, that's it. So, I hope you liked our video. Thanks I'm... again, Ravlin, for um, tagging us. And now we gotta do it. We're tagging for Ruth and Chanel. Hopefully, you guys do it. If you do, I'll put a link in this description as well. I need to get to see theirs. Happy holidays, everyone. Happy birthday, Jesus. And last but not least, Merry Christmas. Yeah, have a good Christmas. Enjoy the food. Let's do it at the same time. Merry, Merry Christmas! Christmas. <laughs>